simulation facility. I'm Charlie Bolden. I've flown the shuttle into space four times, twice as a commander. My colleagues have put together an interesting little experience for you today. You're about to go on a high-fidelity launch simulation, and I'm going to help you get through it. See, before any launch, all astronauts have spent thousands of hours being tested and trained in simulators, a lot like the one you're going to ride. You'll be riding in a special module that fits right into the payload bay. But before you go aboard, we'd better go over a few basics. Launch preparation for your mission would have started accelerating here at KSC months in advance. But let's cut through all that and move you way closer to launch. I'll start your clock at, say, uh, four hours before liftoff, when it's still dark out. Before you got suited up, the shuttle's external tanker ET was fueled up. The ET holds fuel for the shuttle's three main engines. Inside the ET, there are actually two separate tanks. One has liquid hydrogen at 423 degrees below zero. The other, liquid oxygen at 298 degrees below zero. They start really cold. But when those two liquids meet in the shuttle engines, <laughs> you'll find out. About two hours before you launch, you boarded the orbiter through what we call the white room. As you climb through the hatch, that orbiter already seemed like it was a living, breathing thing. Then they pulled back the access arm and left. Everybody else is smart enough to get out of the air and fast. And you and your crewmates are strapped to the reason why. With it four hundred feet of the pad, the flames and heat from the engines will kill you. With an 800 feet, the sound will kill you. With it 4,000 feet, the snakes and alligators might kill you, because all that low frequency vibration really scares them up. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's back it up to T minus 10 seconds. Those sparks are hydrogen free burners or sparklers. They don't prevent a fire or explosion by burning off any excess fuel around your vehicle. At T minus 6.6 .6 seconds,
take your chances in the sim and hope the sim supervisor goes easy on you. Now it's time for you to experience the sim.